Yo, what is up, Jim Ballers? It's me, Jim Balls, back with another video. Uh, talking about a subject we already talked about before, but uh, some recent developments have uh, occurred. Uh, stakes have been raised, so I felt like I had to make another video, follow-up video, talk about it again. Over a month ago, I made this video, uh, Small Artists Hacking Onto Large Artists Spotify Profiles, where I talked about this guy, T-Bands. He basically lied about getting rice gum and I show speed features, basically to YouTubers who also make music. Lied about getting features from them to get featured on their Spotify profiles, right? Checking back in on T-Bands here. All of his songs are still up. Still the same three songs. He hasn't made anything new. Still getting monthly listeners, streams, all that. Facing no repercussions at all. He's featured on playlists and stuff, I guess. He's still on I Show Speed's profile here. It still links back here. You go through his singles, like, boom, there's the two T-Band songs, VVS Diamonds, all these potions. But Rice Gum got it fixed. See, it, this links back to just something else. It's a separate uh, artist profile here on Spotify. So Rice Gum got, got his fix, but I Show Speed did not, so. But T-Bands is still chilling. Like I said in the thumbnail, the title, you already know where we're going here. Chief Keef, right? I'm a, I'm a Chief Keef fan. I fuck with Sosa. These bitches love Sosa. Uh, Back from the Dead 2, that's my favorite Chief Keef album. Close to a 10 out of 10. I love Chief Keef. He's, he's classic. He's awesome. Probably one of the most influential rappers of all time. Definitely one of the most uh, influential rappers of the last decade or so. Uh, but yeah, I went on his profile here, you know, he's got 8 million monthly listeners, and I see this song here, Dick Fell Off OMG, and of course that, that raises some eyebrows, kind of makes you be like, like, what is this? Like, of course I want to go check it out, and it's this song made by Guggentog, right? So, uh, I guess we can give it a listen. It's Go through it here. Yo, you know sometimes when you're just having sex and your dick fall off. My dick fell off. Put it back on. I've been going what to do. They just cause it's really big and it's really balls too. My dick fell off. So there you go. Uh, so basically from what I can tell from this is that Guggentog, he's just some meme rapper and he, he, he found out the secret sauce. He found out that he can lie about getting uh, features from Chief Keef and I guess Cemetery as well. Uh, can, we can, if you don't know about Cemetery, you can... So that's Cemetery, right? So obviously, Chief Keef and Cemetery not on this song at all. He lied about getting features from him, and then, boom, he gets featured on on the uh, the profile, which is this is a huge this is a step up here. Uh, I mentioned uh, in the last video, like you probably can't get on like Drake Spotify, right? But I mean, this dude got on Chief Keef. Like obviously, like if we're talking levels, like bottom level, we got like YouTube rappers like Rice Gum, right? But then next level, like Chief Keef, like eight million monthly listeners. That's a lot. And and this meme rapper gets featured on his Spotify profile. Like when was this uploaded? May six. May six. It's May tenth right now. Uh, so this has been on here for four days already. Like forty thousand streams. Like this guy isn't that big. Like this is his biggest song. <laughs> Boom. Hey everyone, uh, this is post-recording Jim Balls. Uh, more info here on Guggentog. He's got another song here with a buttload of features uh, from this guy, uh, Shark Puppet. I, don't, I really don't know who these guys are, but <laughs> Summers, <laughs> Annoying Orange, and a Space Ghost Perp, and they all uh, link back to the respective uh, Spotify profiles. So this guy is just going all out on uh, cheating the system. <laughs> hey everyone, uh, Jim Balls here, back again. Second update this time. 
Uh, it's now May 11th, the day I'm uploading this video. Uh, checking back in on Guggentog here on the song Dick Fell Off. Looks like he uh, got rid of uh, the Chief Keef thing. It's no longer on Chief Keef's Spotify, but he added just a fuck ton of other people. Keith Ape, Cemetery still there, Sig Carlito, Space Girls Perp, Summers, Vamp Leak, Young Chris, Zelly. Uh, there's it's just so many fucking names you can't even see them all so uh it, it got fixed off of uh chief Keef's spotify profile but now it's on just like a bunch of fucking other people's whoever all these guys are so yeah uh of course he's a little b fan too lots of meme rappers like little b too i fuck with the bass god uh but it's crazy like in the last video i mentioned like is this gonna be a new thing and it's looking like it is like we're, we're, we're there's levels to this and boom we're up at the next level like chief keef D dudes are hacking on a chief keef spotify profile by lying saying they got a feature from when they didn't and they're getting streams clicks off of it it's it's free promotion it's secret sauce you're hacking the system it's crazy <laughs> uh i use distro kid i make music myself right so i'll just get off of this leave uh, so here's the songs I have uploaded, and let's just say I'm gonna upload a new song, right? Okay, it's uploaded to all the different things, streaming services, whatever. Scroll down, let's just skip all this, it doesn't even matter. Song title, I'm, I'm gonna just call it Swag. And look, add featured artist to the song title, right? Boom, featured artist, I'll say Chief Keef. And then boom, song title, Swag. Jim Balls featuring Chief Keith. And the thing is, all these other people, T Bands, uh, what was this guy's name? Like Guggentog. Yeah, Guggentog. These guys probably just use Spotify too. I mean, not Spotify, but DistroKid to upload their songs, right? And, and it might just be this easy. Like, you just go through, you upload your song, give it a song title, add featured artists, boom, there's Chief Keith. And that's all you have to do is to just get DistroKid, upload your song, <laughs> and, and just lie saying you got this this feature when you didn't, and then it just might be that easy. Boom, I just typed in Chief Keef. Uh, Chief Keef, I'm seeing this now. Ensure artists are linked correctly. Chief Keef already has artist profiles. You can link the spot. I'm just seeing this now for the first time. You can link the Spotify URL. This is incredible. This literally is how they're doing it. How to find your Spotify. This is literally how they're doing it. <laughs> I'm just figuring this out live right here. So you, you literally can just do that. Get on their profile. It's just that easy. It, it really makes you wonder how long this is going to be a, a cheat code, a secret sauce, you know? Uh, if it's just that easy. You can just link the Spotify artist URLs right there and then... Boom, I, I can get on Chief Keef Spotify. It's it's really incredible. I don't know what else I have to say there. But, like, they gotta fix this, right? Like, getting on to Rice Gums, uh, Spotify profile, like, like, who cares? Who cares? If you get onto that, who cares? But if, if you can get onto, like, Chief Keef Spotify profile and it's really just that easy, that's, that is insane. <laughs> but, yeah, thanks Jim Ballers for watching. Uh, I'm out swag.